Hi everybody, welcome to GT Coding. In this tutorial series, we're going to design this website from scratch using React.js and Sanity.io. So this is how the website looks. We have this hero section over here and if you scroll down, we have this section where it displays the topics of our course and uh, when we hover over any of these uh, points, we can see that the image changes over here on the right. And if you scroll down, we have the next section where we have the information about our course. And if you scroll down even more, we have the post section. And uh, if you scroll down, we have the testimonial section. And then if you scroll down, we have the footer. And this is completely responsive. So if I decrease the width of this uh, browser window, this is how it will look on a tablet. So here we can see it looks great on a tablet as well. And for the blog section, we have a different layout. And even for the testimonials, we have a different layout. And then we have the footer. And if I decrease the width of the browser window even more, now this is how it will look on a smartphone. So for the smartphone, we don't have the menu items displayed over here. We just have this menu icon. And if I click on that, we have the menu displayed over here. And if I click on any of these uh, menu items, we are taken to that section. So we have different layouts for different sections uh, when we are on a smartphone. Even on the desktop version, we can click on any of these uh, menu items and we'll be taken to that section. Now the data that you see over here in the blog post is fetched from Sanity.io. So we haven't hard coded this data into the HTML. And even for the testimonials, this data is coming from Sanity.io. Now we're going to create this design from a Figma file. So I have already created a video on how to create this complete design in Figma. So here we can see this is the Figma file and we have the design of our website over here. And we're going to reference this design and create our website. Now, if you want to learn how to create this design in Figma, you can watch my video on that. I will leave the link in the description of this video. And I will also leave the link of the Figma file in the description. All right, so this was just an introduction. From the next video, we will start creating our project. So if you have any doubts, you can ask in the comments below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button. And also subscribe to this channel to get the notification about the next videos in the series. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.